All right, we are here with Alexander Gustafsson, who will be fighting uh, Saturday, January 24th, in his home country of Sweden, Stockholm, UFC on Fox against Anthony Johnson. First of all, thank you very much for the time. We appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, what does it mean to you to be fighting in your home country? Uh, well, it means a lot to me. It's a, it's a dream come true for me to fight. Not in my home, uh, you know, home country. It's also my home city, uh, Stockholm, and it's, it's a huge arena. So it's going to be packed, and uh, I'm very excited for it. So, what um, what do you see in a fighter like uh, Anthony Johnson, a guy who used to fight at 170, which is you know he struggled to make 170, but it was unbelievable. That guy used to fight at 170, now fights at 205. What do you see in a fighter like him? Well, he's. It's a, I see a lot of force, you know, he's, um, he's a strong guy with uh, heavy hands, he's very explosive, uh, you know, he's, he's going to bring his, his, uh, his A game for this fight, so, uh, so yeah, you know, I, I, feel, I, I see a great fight, I see an entertaining fight, but I see me as a winner, it doesn't matter where it ends up, I'm, I'm going to win the fight. What? Um what, what do you think of the light heavyweight division right now? You, I mean, you're, you're doing this media tour with Phil Davis. You guys are both top five. Um, you got four of the top seven ranked fighters on this card. What do you think of the light heavyweight division? How, do you think it's the deepest in the UFC? Well, you, you got some really good divisions in the UFC. Uh, so I, I, don't really, I don't know where the light heavy is. Uh, but it's, it's 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 a heavy division. Some good guys, some good names, uh, and we have the you know the champion Jones, who's uh, you, know, uh, you know one of the best fighters in the world right now in any division. So it's it's a packed division. Uh, you know, you had that amazing fight with John Jones, of course, back at UFC 165. What did you learn about yourself in that fight? Uh, I learn, you know, I, I, I know I know how it is to go five rounds, uh, well, my first five rounder, and uh, I know I got the tools to be the be the champ. So, so that's what I learned. Um, what What did you think? You know, it's been a couple of weeks, but what did you think of the John Jones Daniel Cormier fight? Uh, well. John Jones did what he had to do to win the fight. Uh, I didn't see any spectacular things, but uh, I saw a great performance. Uh, you know, he, he did good against uh, DC. You know, and and uh, he, you know, he took the fight to him. And uh, he didn't see that much of, of a reach advantage. Like he didn't use his reach that he used to, that I thought he would do. Mm -hmm. He was wrestling a wrestler and. Uh, just, you know, he, he really put the point in that fight and, and took him down. He, he did good. Now, uh, going into your fight against Anthony Johnson, have you been studying him a lot or have you been more focused on your techniques and what you need to do? Uh, well, uh, both. I've been studying a lot. Uh, I mean, I've been focusing on my own thing too. Uh, so I'm ready. I, I've done my homework. What motivates you? Uh, right now, this fight motivates me um, to be the you know world champion. One day motivates me. Now you got a pretty good beard going. Thank Are you, you gonna keep it for the fight? Well, I'm gonna uh, you know I'm gonna fix it though. <laughs> <laughs> In camp, I don't do it like I don't I don't touch it under the camp. I just let it grow and before I fight, I, I trim it. And trim it up a little. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, uh, we appreciate the time. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Gustafsson versus Johnson, UFC on Fox, January 24th, Stockholm, Sweden. What's that place going to be like? It's going to be crazy. I, I can't even, I don't even know how crazy it's going to be. I just know it's going to be the craziest thing I've ever been on. What's it been like? I mean, in, in the city, I assume you've been there. Yeah, and, you know, it's, it's a very hyped fight, fight and fight card, a very hyped event, so it's going to be packed and just, you know, the time different will be a factor and it's, it's going to be insane. When's the last time you fought in Stockholm? 2012. Yeah, and what was it like then? Is, it, is there a different vibe this time, or is it the same? Yeah. What's it like? No, you know, I fought 2012 uh, in, in the Globe, in Stockholm, and that is absolutely the loudest arena I've been in so far in my career, and this is 
add, add twice as much people. So it's going to be crazy. All right. Thanks so much for the time. Thank you.